and struggle stalwart Dennis Goldberg has been honored with a musical tribute in Cape Town. The Ravonia trialist who is battling lung cancer turned 85 earlier this week. His Legacy Foundation is raising funds for a youth arts and culture facility for the less fortunate youth in Hart Bay. A musical celebration in honor of a freedom fighter and political activist. Dennis Goldberg spent 22 years in jail after his conviction during the Ravonia trial in 1963. He was the only white MK operative sentenced to life imprisonment alongside Nelson Mandela, Walter Sisulu and others. Diagnosed with lung cancer recently, Goldberg, an avid lover of music and the arts, says he's determined to see the House of Hope project completed in his lifetime. The young people are surrounded, they go to school and they're offered a future which they can't realize. Nobody can give it to them. Only we as a country, as a people. But they are the people. And so my idea is, I've seen the way in a music project I support, the Kroonendal Music Academy of Hart Bay. I've seen young people come out of school bubbling over with excitement. They get a sandwich, they get a cup of soup in the winter, and they make music. And they make it together. Musicians from across the area genres have participated in the fundraiser, committing themselves to helping realize the arts and culture center for the impoverished youth in Hart Bay. Uh, social cohesion is something that he's always spoken about when it was not fashionable. So I'm grateful that I'm part of this um, celebrating his 85th birthday and fundraising for the, for the House of Hope. Um, he's, uh, he could have sat at home with his family or friends or people very close to him and had lunch or dinner, but he decided he wants to dedicate his life to the children of South Africa and I'm very grateful to be part of that. Proceeds of the concert will go to the Dennis Goldberg Legacy Foundation's Fund for the House of Hope project. Vanessa Puna, SABC News, Cape Town.